Well, it is April 29th and we're getting stuff ready around the house and with all of our gear, getting psyched for summer. Part of that is testing out our camper to see how it fits in our truck we got this year. We haven't put it in yet, so let's make sure this works. He's gonna get the trailer moved out of the way and then we're gonna back it up and we, he uses his DeWalt um, with a special bit on it to do the jacks. They are manual jacks. So I'll do that in time lapse here real quick and see where we get. Oh, and stick around because I'll give you a tour after and tell you what kind of things we did when we renovated this in 2020. That was really close. Um, I was back here, you know, making sure that he was lined up, centered in between, and I didn't realize how close he had gotten. And I don't know if you can tell, but he basically, I mean, there's like this much wiggle room and he got right under it. Normally I'm supposed to be on the side by now, checking and letting him know if he has enough clearance, but it worked out. So he ran inside. This year we're using a Brophy mount system. We haven't used that one on our truck before. Um, he used to have these ones where it like comes out of the frame on our previous truck But anyway with the brophy style It's gonna go up over the side rail of the bed and we want to make sure that it doesn't stick out too far Where it's going to hit our jacks when you're backing in under it. I'll just show you real quick This is how close it was Like wow, I was not paying attention at all. So that was lucky And we're gonna take two, come back and do this a little later. We're gonna install the brophy mounts first. Did a bunch of measuring. It's gonna be super tight, but I think it's gonna work. So I'll be wearing something different when I come back. All right, it's a different day, like I said. We're here putting it on. Here we go. Yeah, now you have an in. This is seriously like the most stressful part of camping season every year and every time if you get a new truck then you don't know if it's gonna fit <laughs> so ah. especially the top like knowing once it gets in if that if that's gonna work we did it so we still have to get it down and we're gonna he's making sure it's perfectly centered and everything but it worked So we just pop the top. We're gonna get the bed and all the curtains and the cushions. So the toilet goes here. We have a chemical toilet and then that lid covers it back up. Cushions cover the whole thing. This swaps out so you can put a little bed right here. And then the top is a full size. Over here, we just got a counter and a tub goes in here and then our Yeti cooler goes here and that's our refrigerator um so so now we are getting the curtains hung up this is one of my favorite renovations um that I've done on anything before during the pandemic when the pandemic first hit this was something we gutted the camper took out all the original 90s fabric on everything um cushions curtains all of that and we bought this durable sun fabric which we used on the cushions and on a couple of the curtains and I'll get it all put together and show you guys I'm looking over here but you're over here I'll get it all put together and show you guys some of it is actually velcro strips 
with corresponding strips on here. Basically. Voila. Now typically we don't drive like this because we do want to see through. So we'll set that there for now. And then the biggest part is these, it has these little track pieces that go into the track there. And then that gives you the privacy for the bed area. So then we've got that. And it's all lined with this, um, it's a second layer of material and that's actually sun blocking. So blackout, blackout curtains. All right, and Brandon's got the toilet put in. He's got a board to hold it in place so it doesn't bounce when we're driving. This whole little thing opens up. That's how we slide the toilet in and out because it's heavy with the water in it. And we'll get out of here. All right, and we've got full banquet. You wouldn't even know there's a bathroom there. Now that the camper's loaded into the vehicle and we've got some basics in there, we are officially ready for summer in Alaska. Stay tuned, lots of adventures coming. Please like, subscribe, and come back for more.